Excel for iOS Overview – What You Can and Cannot Do Introduction This tutorial serves as an introductory guide to Excel for iOS, with special focus in the available functions of the mobile version in contrast with the original software. Excel for iOS is now available for free at the iTunes Store. Number 1. Open, Create, Edit, and Save Documents Excel for iOS allows you to open and save existing documents created in your computer or other device. These files can be retrieved and stored either locally or using cloud storage as iCloud, Dropbox, or OneDrive. Then you will be able to edit the individual cells, just as in the full desktop version. Number 2. Advanced Functions Excel for iOS allows you to access a wide variety of formulas, counting with a special formula shortcut system with a touch keyboard to facilitate access to them. The data can be filtered and customized, including adjusting columns, rows, and text. The freeze and unfreeze capabilities are also available in Excel for iOS, as well as the autofill function, managing of sheets, wrapping words, number formatting, and creation of shapes and charts. Number 3. What You Cannot Do Excel for iOS has, however, some limitations to be noted. Pivot table styles are not possible to customize or even create in the mobile version. The same goes for custom colors to shapes and WordArt's data customization and creation. Other advanced popular functions such as shadows and reflection effects for pictures are not available, including adding or modifying chart elements, although you can, however, add charts for free. Naming cells or ranges is also not allowed, as well as creating conditional formatting rules or entering array formulas. As Excel for iOS was optimized for mobile devices, the ribbon is not available at the top of the screen when you are using an iPhone, although many of its customization options will pop up once a cell is tapped. Finally, while you can visualize comments embedded in an existing document, you won't be able to edit or create them.